Greetings fellow Vita fans, this is James with PS Vita at 2am coming at you once again with another exciting video. And if you're new here and love everything PlayStation Vita, don't forget to subscribe. To say that the PlayStation Vita is full of surprises would be kind of an understatement, wouldn't it? And I think I just would be repeating myself by saying it, but I guess I'll say it again. It is full of surprises. <laughs> saying that never gets old. We have a very ambitious game coming to our handheld. This is a title I previously covered a while back, but I I wanted to bring more awareness to its development, or even quite honestly, just its existence. Now before I begin, I just have to mention real quickly that this title is still in development, as I just said like 10 seconds ago, and being as such, it currently does not have any kind of gameplay samples to show as of yet. So this video is going to be a little bit more tricky to make, and while I may not have any gameplay to show you all, I have plenty of screenshots. Well, mm, okay, screenshots might be stretching things a bit much, it's more in the way of concept art, but there are some screenshots thrown in for good measure. So if there was any time to get hyped, it would be right now. The game in question is called Alt Bosnia. Previously, when I had first talked about this game, all we had was this blurry screenshot that the developer had released to go off of. And while this game is still shrouded in mystery, here's what we know so far. The title is going to be a tactical turn-based RPG. It will be suited for one player's, wait, one player's? And its story includes something called Silent Void, a special unit made up of human and robot members who must secure and maintain peace in near future Bosnia. Indie developer Harris Majgik, apologies if I'm not pronouncing your name right, has shared new details and concept art for his upcoming turn-based game Alt Bosnia. The Silent Void unit is made up of human and robot members. More on the Silent Void unit missions will be revealed as the release date gets closer. Alt Bosnia is scheduled to release first on the PlayStation Vita sometime in 2020. You heard me right everyone, we have another PlayStation PlayStation Vita game to look forward to in the year 2020. Just add them to the pile at this point. Just add them to the pile. Followed by a version for the PC via Steam later, which is still to be announced by the way. Originally the game was planned for release in late 2019, but as the scope proved to be larger, Harris Majuk decided to use more time on the game's development. Which I'll just say right now, take all the time you need man. I would much rather have a game that is delayed but plays excellently, than a game to come out on time but plays poorly. And I'm pretty sure I speak for most of us when I say that, don't I? Now you all remember that blurry screenshot I showed you earlier? It's finally been, uh, unblurred. Is that a word? Yeah. And this is what the game officially looks like now. Yeah. So you can tell when the description says that this is going to be a much larger scope than he had anticipated. That is quite the understatement in my opinion. I can't believe an individual is creating a game up to this magnitude. And as I said earlier, one of the main reasons why I'm posting this video in the first place is that I wanted to create awareness for this individual. Please, please guys, share this video and let others know about this upcoming game. I got a feeling a lot of people don't know about it. And also, I'll have a link down to his Twitter below. Please follow and support him. He deserves way more attention than he gets. And with more followers and people supporting his work, I'm sure it'll give him all the motivation he needs to keep pushing forward with this project. Because as you can see, it's shaping up to be pretty grand. And don't worry, I'll keep you up to date on everything regarding this game. But let me know how you feel about it. Do you think it's shaping up to be pretty good? With the way it's looking, I'm pretty sure that's going to be a definite yes. But let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comment section. And as always, fellow Vita fans, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch this video. It really means a lot to me. Love you all, and I'll see you next time. The following video has been brought to you in part by all of these wonderfully generous people, including Hero Acer, Adam Sondi, Dennis R. Huggins Jr., Richard Cruz, Mario Cruz, Phantom XRS, Saul Ramirez, Kyle Brooks, JR, E-Rock, Pierce Sterner, Adam Thury, Sculpture Tugel TCG, BMF, Ruben Gutierrez, Joshua Williams, Jared Hado, Kevin Enright, Heston Joseph, Aaron Swanson, Rodrigo Vera, Mango Man, and Reiko Star. If you yourself would be interested in supporting the channel, check the links down in the description below. I have plenty of ways for you to do so down there. Oh, this game is turning out to be so good. I wish it were the year 2020 right now. Actually, scratch that. It means I'd be one year older. And at my age, that's not really a good thing. Wow, midlife crisis much?